Hello, I'm recording myself uh, showing how you can use the counter down on RS Logix. And in my previous uh, video, I showed the uh, counter up. So uh, there is a, sl a small um, difference in how they operate. So it is important to learn uh, both of them. So um, I'm opening a new file. Now, I need uh, two lines. And uh, I'm going to grab an input here. And for the input, I'm going to use the any typical address that is suitable for input. I do that quickly. I put that input. Now I'm grabbing my counter down, it's CPD. Now for the name for the counter, I'm going to use um, this one here. And that is my um, counter number one. If you have multiple counters, uh, be careful of using proper labels. For that one, I'm going to put minus 3 and um, I'm happy with that 0. Now, another uh, normally open contact for the next line. And for this one, I'm going to use the address for the pin. So, it could be that. Uh, you see that the slash dn, that means that I'm using that pin. This will be energized once this one is energized. Um, and now I'm going to say done pin one. Now I have output. For example, it can be a light for the output imaginary in this case because uh, we are using emulators. We don't have the actual PC. Uh, output and we are done now I'm just quickly verifying it no error so what happens is um, I'm going to put the force on this pin and take the force off put it back on take it off that way I'm manually uh, passing a pulse to this counter and um, we see what happens We'll testing um, CTD. That will be the name of my file. And yeah, um, so I go to my run mode, and here we go. So once it is in run mode, uh, automatically you have the down pin activated, energized, and also the connected uh, contact is also energized, and so the output. So this. Can, um, you can assume that is a light indicating that the, um, the counter uh, has uh, the down pin activated. It has some applications. Uh, for the project washing machine, you might not necessarily need this uh, counter down. But uh, hopefully in next semester, you're going to see some projects that um, um, this counter down um, is becoming useful. Now I'm just going to do right click and put the force on. You see that the CD pin is activated once I have a power around my contact. I take that off. So you see the number for the uh, accumulate, accumulated value is different and it is negative in this case. So this would be the difference between the counter up and counter down. Now I Remove the force and put the force back on. Now you see it is minus 2. So uh, the next value is minus 3. I take the force off and then another one. Now I have minus 3. So you see that in this case I have the preset value equal to accumulated value. But... Uh, what is happening is I have 
energized pain on CD and on Dean, uh, on Don pain, sorry for my language. And then uh, I have the output also. So the, the next force or the next pulse on the edge uh, is going to change things. I'm going to show what do I mean by that. Take the force off and then the next one. As you can see, my accumulated value is um, lower than my preset value. This is minus 4 and this is minus 3. So the down pin is not energized anymore. And also the connected contact and the output. So this would be uh, the main um, difference between the, the counter down and counter up. Okay, thank you. Good luck.